so fourth through eighth place victory. Oh, wait, yes, because I was going to say, because it, these are actually matches that I'm uploading that I got a bunch of kills in. I think there's two matches where I got four kills, which really, I don't know what came over me all those times. It's probably all the violence on the video games and TV. Complete a bounty. Okay, match quests. We're going to damage energy players with SMGs, I think. That's the one that I have the most chance of getting any anywhere near it done. Probably not going to happen. I'm hoping not to have to damage anybody, you know? They're all just here to do their challenges, like I am too. Aren't we all? Don't need to get in anyone's face. Not trying to sling any beef. It's not a Wendy's. Trying to show anyone up. Just want to do a little fishing, maybe. Use some of those nice looking new fishing holes. And land good and far from the line. So, this could be a place. That's good and far from the line, and it's not yet uncovered, but it's close to the beginning of the line, so it's a little risky. Plus, it's near these sort of near POIs. But that's probably the best place to go, to be honest. Right over here, the, the island. Snake should be up there. Snake? Snake! Wait, what do we, what do we have to, what am I supposed to be doing for Snake? I forgot already. I need to hide in boxes. I need to destroy security cameras. A surveillance camera? That was the best thing about playing Metal Gear Solid. Every time a new object or concept or name would be introduced, Snake would just repeat it with this, this puzzled expression, a puzzled voice expression. The DARPA chief? Metal Gear. Foxhound? Yeah. Okay, so, down to 92 players. Okay, so, need to avoid all the people, not get damaged by the people, uh, so that I can be uh, emerge pristine at the end of the match. Um... Avoid getting trampled by rhinoceroses or wildebeests or, um, I don't know, vampire bats if they walk on the ground. Um, avoid, avoid getting trampled by Edward Cullen or Edward Cullen's spinoff, the guy from Fifty Shades of Grey. Oh man, oh man, speaking of YouTubes. The long-awaited new video by ContraPoints came out the other day. Three hours long. That's kind of worth the wait. But it's all about Twilight. I'm learning so much about Twilight. Okay, this is no build, so there's really no point in me breaking these trees. It's, all that's doing is making me more exposed. You never got into the games, Metal Gear Solid. Metal Gear Solid, the original for PlayStation was like, that was groundbreaking. Metal Gear Solid 2 was certainly uh, long-awaited, because everyone loved Metal Gear Solid 1 so much, but had a little twist. They came out with a free demo of it, and uh, the demo... Oh, fuck! No! Oh, my God. Snake should sell boxes and such? He should. Is that him? Is Snake going to go kick someone's ass for me? Thank God. I thought that one would never leave. Do I want that? Auto shot a yes. Two chests here. Oh, man. Okay. Um, what, what did that... What did I just pick up? This glowing thing. Bars. Uh, pump shotgun? No. Auto shot is good. Good enough. That's enough shotgun. Alright, I'm going to need to take stock of my weapons pretty soon, because I've picked up too many things. I don't know what they are. Alright, let's do that. Oh shit, there's asshole over there. Motherfucker! Okay, normally I try not to engage the assholes. But 
But that one was being so annoying. And now Solid Snake's my friend, right? Because I killed his... The enemy of my enemy is my, my friend. That should be how it works, right? Okay. Eat the minis. That's all the minis I can have. I keep the med kits, I guess. I don't need two of this auto shoddy, though. Do I keep the Iron Warrior or the Cover Fire? Mag. Reduce time to ADS. No. Who cares about that? Keep this one. And the Rocket Launcher. Or do I want an AR? No, I don't need an AR. Okay, and then there's one more chest, and then I should look at where the circle is. Getting some good bars here. Yeah, run gun hammer pump. Huh. Can I how come I can't can we can we ball here? Is there bowling? There should be bowling. Ooh, ooh, shield fish, I like this. Two fishes. Excellent. Okay. So, looking at the map, I'm in the circle. Uh, I'm still going to be in the circle, so I don't need to go anywhere. But, now that I've uncovered the map here, maybe I should go uncover some other map. What if we go... Or do I have quests I need to do anywhere? Use a hiding spot, open things, damage people. Um, I don't know. I'll just go over there. This is not a great place to hide right here. It's There's no cover. Oh, Snake. What do you do, Snake? What do you do? Oh, he gives me a box! Look at that. Wait, wait, where'd it go? No, he didn't. He was gonna give me a box. Buy the box, okay. I will buy your mythic box. And I could hire him. Do I want to hire him? No. He's just going to make noise. Okay. So, this is all the um, boxing that I need to do because the quest is to, to use a box in different matches. And I've already done it here. I'm not being very stealthy here. I think people will know. It would be nice to have this half pot, though. What do I? What would I lose for the half pot? The sniper rifle, the missile launcher. One rocket is not going to help me. Yeah, we take the half pot and lose the uh, lose the box for the med kits. I don't need more boxes. You think there's travel in the box? Oh shit! Is there? Um, well, I don't have one, I don't think. Unless it's in one of these other places, but, uh, I don't see it. Don't see it. Okay. So, got me shotgun, my SMG. My sniper rifle. I hear some footsteps over there. Oh shit! That's a fucking asshole. Where'd they go? Where did they go? You bastard! Disturbing my peace. I was just hanging out, remembering what weapons I had. That was a real person. Come on, dude. You could do better than that. Hey, man, how are you? I'm doing good. How about yourself, TTV troller Andreas? A yellow circle down there. The yellow circle is a person carrying a medallion, right? Which heals them, but lets everyone else see them. It's kind of like the one ring. So, 
So, I probably don't want to engage the circle because that person is going to be tough, right? I want to I want to fight like people who are weak so that I can win and, you know, be able to overpower them or better yet, not fight anyone at all. There's no need for violence. Never solved anything. I mean, some international conflicts, sure, but what else? What else has violence ever solved? Uh, do I do I take the blue AR over the sniper? I think I do. Yeah, I don't need a snipe. What I need is to do damage, and blue weapons will help me do that. I've set a mark over there, just to give myself a thing to do. No need to go over there. Which, maybe I should reconsider. Maybe I should just stay here, you know? Here's fine. Oh, except... These motherfuckers. Jesus! I thought they'd never leave. How's it going, Amy Boo? Color up the SMG. I have already had to kill two assholes. They're snooping around my end of the map. This is mine. I live here. No! What was that? Oh, damn it. Get off my property! Don't care if the bank gave you a deed! Are these all bots? Why are all the bots over here? And how did they get here? Did they come from that side of the map? What? They're like going around the top just to try and flank me? Badly? No, that was a person. They're spectating me. That seems worse. People should be better than bots. God damn it! Get off my property! Is there some quest to get killed by me? Is that why people keep doing this? I've already got five kills. And I've barely left where I dropped. I dropped there. Everyone keeps jumping in front of my bullets. Okay. I like the shoddy. I'm going to keep the auto shoddy. I'm going to keep the SMG, keep the AR, keep the half pots, the med kit. I mean, I guess I want to keep... It's good to keep both these, right? If only I could also have a sniper rifle. They should let us buy more ammo slot, weapon, weapon slots. For a thousand bars. Well, really, I should just stay here aiming down the hill because more assholes are going to show up. Apparently that's what they do. Down to 14 players. Okay, so, once it gets down to 5 or 6, I will need to go balls to the wall. Change up my strats. Look for a friendo to help me go out and forth. But for now, I just need to play it cool. Hope that no more assholes come. Make me disclose my position by killing their asses again. Although, I think everyone's heard of my position by now. The Bermuda Triangle, they call it up here. Terradino's Bermuda Triangle. Players enter, they never leave. Okay, I'm hearing footsteps. That's another fucking asshole, isn't it? Wait. What? Where are they? Why am I hearing these footsteps so loudly? If someone's not visible. That's really loud, isn't it? Maybe that's the bot, though. 
Oh, alright, got some gunplay going on over there. Asshole business. I'll leave them to that. I don't need to get in their way. They have that under control, it seems like. No one come out from behind me yet? Oh shit, what was that? <laughs> that was a scary sound, but it was it was just celebrating that I've survived some more circles. Down there, okay, there's down there's the person with the medallion. That's who we see on the map. Down to ten players. We need to outlast two more to make it to the winner's circle. Eighth place. Now, if someone does come up from behind me, this is not a great place to be. I'm totally uncovered from the back. But why would anyone be back there? Surely they've learned by now what happens. But wait, there's those footsteps again. Why am I hearing the footsteps? There's no one there. Could it be that the NPC all the way over there that I'm hearing? Those footsteps sound like they're very soft and they're right here. Ridiculous. You know, what if I hide in that bush? The old hide and slide. There's a cloaking device this season. True, yes, the um the EMP stealth camo thing. In fact, there's a quest for using that. I think I need to use it once more. All right. Is that an asshole there? Yes, it is. Or it's an NPC, or it's two NPCs, or two assholes. They wouldn't be teaming. One of them, well, this one's pulsing. That one's just an asshole, I think. Down to six players, which means it's time to go balls to the wall. All right. Where'd he go? All right, where'd he go? He's here somewhere. I can hear him. I keep I keep this SMG. There's a chest here. I want the chest. Now, surely that asshole knows that I'm coming. <gasps> the business! Okay, we take. We lose the medkits for the business. The business is so good. <laughs> Look at me leaving all these doors open. It's not like me. That's how you can tell I'm going balls to the wall. Being so reckless, I'm leaving doors open. Now, okay, there's an asshole around here somewhere. Because I heard him stomping around, and I... Ah! Oh, fuck! God damn it! <laughs> that was not the business button! That was the sax button. You know, I never thought there'd be a wrong time for sex. Well, it turns out there was. I found it. Oh, I had the business. Okay, well, let's have a look at these stats. At least it's a win, you know? Five kills. 29% accuracy. That's slightly below where it's been lately. Damage to players, 929. Very high. Distance traveled two kilometers. But yeah, I barely left that corner of the map. Damage taken, 293. I'd like to see that up around 350, but that's not bad. Damage to structures, 3197. I'd like to see that a little bit higher, but again, not so bad. Rescued three survivors, so we're, we're down two lives. Uh, wow. Okay, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to do some Hail Marys for that. Um, 
Single digits, five a limbs in a match. Now, wouldn't single digits be one? I mean, wouldn't one kill give you... In fact, wouldn't zero kills give you single digits? But I guess five is what it is. Uh, certified as an AR specialist, an SMG specialist, and a shotgun specialist. Those are the three weapons I shot people with. All right, well, that's a win. Technically a win. Could be a better win, but, uh, you know, it's not bad. 